find out about your first round opponent and what was your reaction? Twitter. Yeah. <laughs> My Twitter was blowing up and I was like, what's, what's going on? And uh, that's when I saw it and my first reaction was actually like really happy. So um, I think I'm super pumped and like excited to get to play on the big court, I guess. And um, yeah, like everyone is like, oh, like bad luck with a draw. But me, I'm, I'm, I'm like pretty happy and excited about it. Why do, why do you think it's not bad luck? Well, I think uh, we're going to play on the big court. It's a big match playing against Serena Williams. It's a, uh, it's what everyone is working for, no? Um, to play Australian Open, of course, like first round, but that's how it is, and uh, I'm just pumped about it, and uh, yeah. Linda, what, do you, what are your memories of that match at the Rogers Cup? Against uh, <laughs> the memories, like, they never go away. Uh, they're always there. Uh, the best ones for sure. I still remember like the last game, like every point and everything. So it was for sure my biggest win uh, until now. And I hope I can take this memory and put it to positive energy to be like um, super confident on the court and uh, play w play good. Do you remember thinking after that match or when you talked to your father or whoever about what exactly you thought you did well in that match to get that win? Yes, I think I did very well that I always, you know, even though she killed me the first set or like, um, um, I always stayed there, putting the balls back, playing, trying the best. I always was there. And at some point she also got a little bit uh, like uh, down in the match. And that's where I kind of could take the overhand and get to the third set. And yeah. <laughs> But Andre, it seems as though you've you've had a really tough time in the last year or so physically. How do you feel right now? You, if we were to look at 100%, where where are you right now? Yeah, exactly. Last year was very tough. I got in one injury and then it was a circle into the next one. It just didn't stop, so I wasn't really happy about it. I came back, didn't play very good, didn't find my game. But now I think I'm really motivated to play, first of all. I'm, I'm so happy to be here. Uh, physically, I have nothing that bothers me except this thing in Sydney <laughs> and um, no I think I'm, I'm pretty close to 100% people, people saw when the draw came out you used like a dangerous floater you know someone who could cause a lot of trouble for anybody do you do you feel yourself that way do you think that you can are somebody who Serena should be not afra afraid of or you know ready to possibly make some uh, noise here yeah, of course I want to see myself that way. I think I had good results when I was playing. Of course I was injured, so it was not that great. But first of all, every first round opponent is a dangerous floater, you know, so you have to be careful with everyone. But uh, I mean, we played each other two times already, so we both know what to expect now. And, and I think it will be for sure a good match. Yeah. How is the toe of Linda? And are it's you concerned? Good. <laughs> it fell off. <laughs> if you want to see a video or something. <laughs> no, no, it's 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 okay. Um, the physios uh, take good care of me. They tape it uh, for the match, uh, for the practices. So when I stop, it's not that bad. I made a hole into my shoe, so I don't put it like this. But um, it's a common tennis injury. But it's the first time I had this. I was like. <laughs> <laughs>